A man was drinking water from a water hole when two women walk up to him and start laughing. One of them then asks why the man is drinking that water and then asks if he wanted some water. He then replies yes and she throws water on him. She then starts laughing, so her friend asks her why she did that. The woman then says that she was just playing with the man and that her friend should stop trying to defend him. She then takes the bottle from her friend's hand and throws water at her. The friend then asks why she did that and the woman says it was for her to learn not to do that anymore. The friend then leaves and the woman helps the man to his feet. He then thanks the woman for her help. The woman then gives the man a bottle of water and tells him to drink that water. Later, the woman is working when her friend arrives and says that she forgave the woman, but the woman says that she shouldn't have done that. The friend then asks if the woman would continue to defend that homeless person and then the woman says that she really hadn't learned anything. She then says they should get back to work and so they do. At that moment, the man arrives at the restaurant and then the friend goes to him. The man then greets the friend, and then he says he had a reservation at that restaurant and asks her to confirm it for him. She then asks him to wait a moment and then goes to the book. She then asks the man's name and he answers it for her. She says the man's reservation was right and then tells her which table was his. When she arrives at the table, she says the man could have a seat. She then asks the man if he would like to order anything else. At this time, the woman arrives and says that she would attend to that man. She then hands the man the menu and tells him that if he had any questions about any of the items on the menu, he could call her. She then says that if the man wanted any kind of drink, he could ask for it, as they would prepare it for him. He then said that he would like a glass of water and then the woman said that she would get it for him. The other woman then tells the woman that she knew what she was doing. She says that man was very rich and he wouldn't want to be with her. She said she was much younger and more attractive than the woman. The woman then says that she was getting things wrong because she didn't mean to do that. The other woman then says that she must have been seeing things and that the woman was just a very helpful woman who was trying to serve a customer. The woman then tells her to stop that and takes the water to the man. The other woman then says that she knew what the woman was doing. She then ends up finding a box on the floor and picks it up. She is very surprised to see what she had inside the box. The woman then looks at what her friend was doing and is very sad about it. She then takes water to the man and hands it to him. The man then asks the woman what her name was. She then says the name to the man and then he asks her why she took off the lipstick she was wearing, because he thought it was very beautiful. She then freaks out about it and says that she had to take her lipstick off in order to work. She says that she must have looked pretty ugly without him, but the man says that she was as beautiful as ever. She then said that she had a question for the man, but he says that first he would propose to her. The man then says that the woman seemed to be very scared of something and asks who her pattern was. She then says that she had not yet met her boss, as she had only worked there for a short time. She says that she didn't know him, but that she heard his name somewhere. The man then asks the boss's last name and she tells the man. He then says that he needed to tell the woman the truth. He then says that the truth was that he didn't go to the restaurant to eat, but to see the woman. She, then, is surprised by that and at that moment, the other woman goes to them. She then tells the man that she would serve him better, but the man said it wasn't necessary as he was already being attended to. He then said that he was already being treated very well and then asked the other woman to leave. She is very sad about it, and then, when she leaves, the man asks if the woman was all right. She says yes and then asks if the man was, in fact, the owner of the restaurant. He then says that in addition to being very beautiful, she was also very smart. He says that he was the owner of that restaurant, but that he didn't talk about it, because all the women who approached him were just out of interest. She is surprised by that and asks why the man didn't say anything when he arrived. He then says that the truth was that he was there to give something back to the woman. 
He then takes the water bottle and asks her if she remembers that. She then asks if that homeless man was, in fact, the man. He then says yes, and that he had done that because he was doing a test with his employees. He says that when he first met the woman, he was impressed by her character and honesty. He says it made him want to meet her. He then says that what most impressed him was that he always tried to find a woman who didn't approach him just because of his money. He says that the woman had done this and that she had defended them without knowing if he had anything to give her in return. The woman, then, is surprised by that and asks the man why he threw the box with a ring inside on the floor. He then says that it was another one of his tests and that it was to test the honesty of his employees. He then says that unfortunately the other woman had failed that test as well. He then said that he knew that was hard to believe, but he had proof, and then shows the woman his cell phone. He then shows that he knew everything the other woman had done, and then he says that it was just a test. He then says that the ring that was inside the box was just for him to see if another woman was honest, but that in fact it was always for the woman to wear. He then asks her to open the box and see what was inside. He then asks the woman if she liked the gift. He then asks if she would like to go out with him, but she says that at the time she was working. He then says that he had one more thing to say to her and that from that moment on, she no longer works at that restaurant. He then gets up and hugs the woman and they leave. When the man walks past the other woman, he says the truth was, she was fired. She then asks the man not to do that, because she really needed that job, but he said that what she really needed was to have more character. He then says that in addition to stealing other people's things, she still took something that wasn't hers as if other people weren't noticing that. He then says he was going to go out with the woman and when he got back, he didn't want to see her there anymore.